This is the instructions for the new uh, 3M tape that I'm using for the Ninja uh, grass blade. It'll come like this, alcohol wipe, you'll have the, the 3M tape and the blade. The instructions are on the back. Let's start. First thing you want to do, piece of sand, piece of sandpaper, lightly sand this area right in here where the blade's going. You see how we I've marked it off. You want the blade to be on top of the trolling motor, whichever side you usually carry it on is the best thing to do. Here's your alcohol wipe. Just make sure the area is wiped clean and um, the back of the blade. Just make sure it's wiped clean. Now one little trick, let me put this aside for a minute. One little trick that I can tell you. You want to use something, and because we're fishermen we always have hooks around. This 3M tape is difficult to take off and it needs to be taken off before this white tape. Take that off and just lift one of the corners, it's much easier. The white tape comes off very easy. There's the tape. All you do is line up one corner, one like that. Now as you see I just messed up and a little bit of tape overhang. Don't worry about it. It's not a big deal. Okay? That's it ladies and gentlemen. We're going to just spot it before we put it on. You want as much of this cutting edge to be exposed as possible. This is one of the new 112 Minn Kotas. And that's it. Press down on it. Remember it's sharp. That's it. That's your installation of the new 3M tape for the Ninja Blades. Let it sit for 24 hours. There's some sort of a chemical reaction in the, in the tape that uh, it's required and you'll get 100% strength. But, and should, after the 24 hours, you'll see that there's a slight twist. That's because of the foam in the tape. Don't worry about it. You won't, you won't be able to lift it off once it's on there. So make sure you get it in the right spot. All right, that's the Ninja Grass Blade with the new 3M tape.